Hey guys and girls, welcome back to another toy box, and today we're carrying on with our Iron Man armor and armory. So, a couple of the changes been made. So we've now got Tony Stark and a hot rod. Uh, we've now got everything joined up. I've added a fire extinguisher. I've broken up the two single stacks and made them up. Now I'll give Tony Stark a proper wrench, and his span is going to live here. So we've now we've got two different types. Uh, I'm planning on getting rid of this, replacing this with a computer, but for now, uh, let's talk about changes. So, this back panel here has had to be extended out, uh, because I've realised the measurements for uh, War Machine, the arm is going to stick out, and it possibly means this guy's going to have to move, because one of the armors I've ordered is a bit big. So, that said, let's open up the War Machine and have a look. So... War Machine, as I've said, is a bit chunky. His armor is uh, massive. So let's start with the basic, shall we? So there's the basic body. Now we'll get this massive piece of armor on. Like so. Oh, his arms can move. I was a bit worried they'd be trapped. So, first time since the Lawman stuff, I've got Rhodes' head. So you've got one like the Tony Stark with a screen and a normal. I'm not going to see it anyway, but I'm going to put the screen face forward. Um, helmet on like that. I love these um, custom Iron Man have clip on masks. So I tried the Iron Man before. So you can just flick it up. Okay. So we've got two fireballs for his hands. Never sure whether to put these in the Hall of Armour so it looks like they're powering up or not. I guess I'll make that decision later on. And that's why I don't like them, because they shoot off. Um, so for now, just to squeeze it in, I'm probably going to leave that off, to be honest. Um, so, gun assembly, which is standard sort of. Now we're going to put them with all the sets now. So... It's one of those clicking jobbies, like so. And the red Lego stud. And this will go on War Machine's back. But when I looked at it, it sits at a weird angle. Because of how chunky the armour is. But that there, guys, is War Machine. So when we built this, this was war machine here and this is blaze because of the extension and to try and keep things symmetrical I've moved it along one space so our war machine will sit there and that's the first of our additional armors so till next time guys stay safe keep gaming